Okay, so one of our members has asked whether I think they're short from 1020 and they want to, you know, they're curious to know whether the stock's going to go, you know, what I think if it's going to go lower or, 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 you know, where the trade is in here. And you can see that this stock, uh, you know, came from 1515 and it's had this huge uh, downtrend, I guess you'd call it. Uh, you know, it came off, consolidated sideways and then broke down and now it's consolidating again. And so a couple of things could happen here, there's no doubt. A couple of things could happen here, there's no doubt on this. And this is that it's, you know, it's forming this uh, consolidation base again. So this could be a one, two, three, four. And you could be looking for wave five to, to, to take this down. And this is, so this is the consolidation area in here like this. And so a couple of things though have happened here. Well, there's three very important key technical ideas that have happened here. One, uh, it breaks out on big volume. Uh, you can't really see it on this chart, but uh, you know, it breaks out on volume. Uh, out of this base pattern. But not only that, this is what you call an engulfing bar. It's a huge engulfing bar and it's green. So that's bullish. So that's number one, or number two. So number one, it breaks out of the trend. Number two, it has uh, an engulfing bullish uh, bar. And then three, you have this quiet inside day. And this is all uh, juxtaposed at this, um, confluence of all these the downtrending chart which is broken above it's broken it's broken out above this channel you've got the engulfing bar and you've got this quiet inside day in my view i would say that this uh stock um and, oh and also so this is support for it here as well right in here the nine you know nine eleven 9.30, 9.20, so it's right at its support level. Uh, if I was short this stock from much higher levels and I had a dollar profit, I, I, would, I would suggest that, um, you know, locking, some, locking the profit in here is probably, you know, probably the, the idea to, to look at. Let's have a look at the daily chart. The, 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 two-minute chart on it. So it has this pop-up, pulls back, and now you can see it's just consolidating on very light volume. It's not a big volume trader anyways. I mean, the other day it did trade uh, close to, I think it was close to a million shares, 800,000, but now it's just dried right up. Though it didn't have any news out, so you know it could continue to fade. Maybe it was a chat room pump or something like that. But from from a technical analysis point of view, this stock is not it's not bearish. Um, at best, it's you know neutral, or it, you know worse, it's neutral, and at best, it's you know it's a bullish chart. So that would be my take on MACK. You could, because it might just grind, might just fade in here from now on. So I think I would be looking to to exit my position if I was in it.